I'm Destin, and this is IGN News. Developer Bungie is working on important tweaks for Destiny's next Iron Banner special event. These include level advantages being more dramatic, new exclusive armor and weapons, and tweaking the bounties. The team says it learned a lot from the community after hosting the Crucible and Queen's Wrath events over the past month. First up, Bungie will make level advantages in Iron Banner much more dramatic between players of wide variation regarding their rank. While the developer wanted to keep advantages small, it now realizes that the separation in power was too conservative. As such, a fire team leader will now need to be level 20 or higher for the next Iron Banner, though lower level players may join a friend who has hit the level requirement. Bungie will also power up the armor rewards for Iron Banner, making them appealing to advanced characters who are equipping only exotic and raid gear. New exclusive armor will also be able to get to 30 light. There also will be new weapon types, increasing from 2 to 4, coming as drops for winning matches and also purchasable with Lord Saladin. In regards to bounties for Iron Banner, Bungie believes they were a bit too demanding the first time. So with the next special event, the team has tuned them down quite a bit and relocated them to Lord Saladin to pick up and turn in. Other changes coming to the next Iron Banner in Destiny include incentives to keep people playing in the next event, even when losing matches, reforging weapons from the event, and the ability to use a 12-hour tempered buff to get a boost in reputation gains. Alterations are still under testing at Bungie, and as such, some of them may be postponed. For more on Destiny, stay tuned to IGN.